Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today, I'm actually going to be showing you the most underrated weapon, in my opinion. Now, I just want to say, guys, this is totally my opinion. A lot of you probably will disagree. However, at the minute, pretty much PvE, all it is is a recluse. Everyone's using that. However, this weapon is a lot different to the recluse. It's actually a primary weapon that is really good and... It's so underrated, it's unbelievable, I hardly see anyone using this weapon. However, I recently picked it up, and it's probably one of the best weapons in the game, to be fair guys, primary wise. I can't really think of anything better, especially for PvE. PvP, it's okay, it's not bad, but we're going to look at the weapon. Now, this weapon is actually the Breakneck. Now, it's a Gambit Bounty, I'm not sure whether you can still get it, I think you can get the bounty from drifter but i think you've got to complete like 40 matches and get a few auto rifle kills so it's not hard to get it's just long and tedious that's the reason why i have took so long to actually get this weapon because i hate gambit however i'm really glad that i've got this weapon i've pretty much been playing for a few hours got 450 kills with this weapon already and pretty much guys this weapon is unbeatable for auto rifle i can't think of anything better in the auto rifle section or anything else in any other section really for a legendary as well for me this should be exotic because of how good it is but guys the perks it does have it comes with polygonal rifling extended mag rampage and then it's got this own perk this is his own perk called onslaught this weapon's rate of fire increases as you stack rampage comes with a range mod and I've also put a backup mag now I would recommend either putting a rampage mod on or a backup mag but pretty much guys these two perks together are absolutely insane so I'm going to show you exactly which is perfect because we've just loaded up escalation protocol now this weapon guys it's an ad killer if you're looking for something to wipe out enemies especially the little ones like frals and with this week being Escalation Protocol, pretty much everyone's doing it, this weapon is brilliant. So after you do get a kill, you get your Rampage. So you get one kill and your rate of fire increases. Now when you stack this three times, honestly, it fires so fast and the amount of DPS you can do with this weapon is insane. Now for a primary, you're not really going to be getting anything better than this. Let me know in the comment section guys. If you think there is a better primary out there for me this is definitely so I'll show you here as you can tell we're getting that rampage and look at how fast it's firing that is pretty much what it is now that's a standard fire guys really slow as you can tell but once we get into like level 2 of this escalation protocol I'll actually show you exactly how well it can come pre now the recluse obviously is an energy weapon and it's really good don't get me wrong guys however if you don't really like pvp or you're not too good at it this is definitely the weapon for you it's not hard to get it's just long and tedious and it's definitely worth it so i'm hoping that we're going to get quite a few ads in a minute so that i can show you this weapon fully but we're going to get one kill and as you can tell the rate of fire's increased and with that rampage mod let's try and get three kills Look at how fast it fires now, guys. Now, if you're killing ads, that is pretty much what you want. But for me, I just think this is definitely the most underrated weapon in the game. Nobody's using it. Literally, I'd look in every match. Nobody's got the breakneck on. And as you can tell, it even melts shields, especially with that triple rampage. So it's definitely a weapon you guys are going to want to be getting, especially before Shadow Keep, because obviously there's going to be a lot of rads, a lot of missions that are going to have loads of rads. So this weapon is definitely for Shadow Keep also. So if you haven't got it, I'd recommend it. And just look at it melt that night, that fral. And even the bosses, it can melt the bosses. 
Now, even if you don't have Rampage, the weapon's still brilliant. It's still a good little weapon. Now, another underrated weapon, which is just a bonus for this video. I'm going to show you it anyway. I was going to make another video. So, if you want me to make a full video on this weapon, let me know. But what I like to do, guys, if I'm running something like Reckoning, where you've got to kill loads of ads, I run these two. Especially because the Callus Mini Tool is basically the Mini Recluse, in my opinion. It's definitely up there with the Recluse as standard. Especially with the Feeding Frenzy perk, that weapon's really good. So that is another one to get. But hopefully, in this Escalation Protocol, I can show you this weapon off. So as you can tell, we've got Triple Rampage now. And you can see how fast it's firing. The only downfall, guys, is that you run out of ammo fast. But with a backup mag, you're pretty much sorted. And it does have a quick reload, guys. So that's one kill. That's two kill. And then this is your third. And then that's a fire rate. But as you can tell, even at range, that is another point I want to say as well, guys, about this weapon. The range on this auto rifle is insane. It's probably one of the furthest ranges on an auto rifle. It's definitely the best auto rifle in the game. I can't really see anything topping this, in my opinion. It literally melts anything. That's pretty much going to wrap up today's video, guys. I just wanted to show off how good this weapon was, because nobody's talking about it, nobody's using it, and hopefully this video does persuade you to actually just get it and try it out for yourselves. Like I said, leave your underrated weapons down in the comment section. I will be reading everything. Hopefully you guys can share something and hopefully tell me a weapon that is better than this. Because if there is one out there, I'll be very surprised and I will be thankful. But that is going to wrap up today's video, guys. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you try this weapon out. If you are new around here, make sure you leave a like, subscribe and comment. Just helps out the channel a lot. If this video could get 20 likes for sharing this pretty much insane weapon, I'd appreciate it. As always, guys, I'll catch you in the next one.